Over buffet for breakfast alongside the right network and of course business executives at the sky floor at the Eco Hotel and Suites and of course overlooking the beautiful new Eco Atlantic, Xavier will be sharing with us how to scale capacity and structure for growth. Now, my name is Arike and this is Around Town brought to you by ConnectNigeria.com. Stick with me and let's have fun. What they are saying is their system is in sync. So there's no disparity between their brand, their identity, with the quality of the people that they have and the quality of the processes that they have. Okay, so I'm here with the person, the brain behind this whole event. How do you feel putting this together? Uh, fantastic. Mission accomplished. My name is Izu, Izu Woma. I am the founder and CEO of Hexavia, Hexavia, Hexavia Business Club and now Breakfast with Izu. Hmm, that's really interesting. So, I mean, why did you put this together? What's what's inspired this breakfast with Izu? Well, I've always I'm a collector. I'm a collector of sound minds. I'm a collector of successful people. So I've always wanted to create a network and a community of those so my collections, right, and get them to interact with each other. I think the difference between you and the next ten years is the person you meet and the things that you know. So I want them to have like an intellectual conversation and exchange of ideas, concepts, even work and project and contract. Hmm. That's what's important. Okay, so what do you expect today? Well, I expect uh, insights, I expect strategy, I expect people that will go back and disrupt how they normally run business, their business models. I want people that can look at forward and backward integrations of what they're currently doing in their business so that we can start to build bigger businesses for Nigeria, world-class brands, brands that can employ a lot more people and solve Nigeria the unemployment problem. Hmm. Okay, so we'll be waiting. I mean, today you're talking about how to scale capacity and structure for growth, right? Yes, how to scale capacity and structure for growth using the balance scorecard as well as disruptive strategies. Right? So you can say, oh, let me say, you can say your corporate culture, and I'm going to give an example of, if you don't know how to find corporate culture, just use, use adjectives. Find adjectives. Right? Right? So you could have corporate culture's adjective, or you, you could use adjectives like corporate as a corporate culture. Innovation is an adjective. Oh, that guy is innovative. Oh, that guy is funny. And I'm not saying your corporate culture should be funny, but the organization where their corporate culture is funny. You just look at these guys, especially with brands, no, maybe not physical brands, brands like, like celebrities, because celebrities are also businesses, right? You can say, oh, controversy, that brands that their core value is controversy. I don't know if you can think of any brand that their core value is controversy. Sahara Reporters, maybe. Sahara Reporters, controversy, is a core value for them. So no matter what Sahara decides to do tomorrow, if Sahara decides to have a Sahara radio, Sahara FM, the FM will be known to be controversial. So they can bring Shakao. Is that his name? Boko Haram guy? They can bring Shakao on radio, right? Whose core, whose core value is to eradicate every non infidels. They can bring Shakao with a classic fiddle. Let me say Adeboye, in quotes. You know what I mean? That's a Christian. That's who they are. If they keep doing that thing, they'll be in business. Just that. It's not necessarily because they brought 